can I, can I, I'm just going to talk to you real quick because we're, we're, provo we're, we're, we help patients. We're all about serving other people, but I want to direct the focus to you because I, I don't know if you noticed, but over the last few years, we've had to handle things that we weren't expected to. We've had to step into roles that weren't even created before this whole pandemic went down. There's a lot riding on your shoulders on top of life and all the other aspects and dynamics brought on by it, like it's a lot. And if you feel like you're struggling, number one, recognize that you've never been through this before and no one else has. So if you're being hard on yourself, I encourage you to give yourself a dose of grace and know that with all that you've been through these last few years, if you feel like you're struggling, you don't have to do that alone. If you're thinking about reaching out to a professional, but you're hesitant, that stigma comes up, maybe you've tried it before and it didn't go well, it's actually a sign of strength to make your mental health and quality of life a priority. Because I'm gonna go my soapbox here real quick. You, I'm talking to you right now, you have a bright light. I truly believe that every single person, and that includes you, were created on purpose for a purpose. To literally beam like a beacon to serve others at your highest level. You were not created to live a mediocre life. You were not created to live in pain. Pain happens. If you stay there, it becomes suffering. That's a choice. Now, that might be hard to hear, but you deserve to live a life worthy of the calling that you have received. So if you feel like that light that you used to have or that, that you, you used to be beaming with, if you feel that's dimming, if you feel that's gone out, if you feel like there's more, there should be more, you should be farther ahead, you feel like you're not living your full potential and it's kind of depressing you, you feel like you're missing something, you owe it to your patients, but most importantly, you owe it to yourself to reignite your light within. So I want to really encourage you, make the call, go on the website, ask about a consultation, reach out. You are worth it. I really hope that this episode helps you and your patients on a topic not talked about enough. So really consider that for both your patients and yourself. Hey, this is Dr. Adam Martin. If you want to listen to the full podcast episode, click the link below.